Hello, and welcome to our video on the refrigeration cycle. A refrigeration cycle is a process that is used to cool a substance or space. This cycle is used in a wide range of applications, including air conditioning, refrigeration, and heat pumps. A refrigeration cycle consists of four main components, the compressor, the condenser, the expansion valve, and the evaporator. The compressor is responsible for compressing the refrigerant gas and sending it to the condenser. In the condenser, the refrigerant gas is cooled and condenses into a high-pressure liquid. A high-pressure liquid then passes through the expansion valve, where its pressure is reduced, causing it to rapidly expand and become a low-pressure gas. A low-pressure gas then enters the evaporator, where it absorbs heat from the surrounding substance, or space. This causes the refrigerant gas to boil, and turn back into a low-pressure vapor. The refrigerant vapor then returns to the compressor, where the cycle starts again. This continuous cycle removes heat from the surrounding substance, or space, which results in cooling. The refrigerant used in the refrigeration cycle is carefully selected to ensure that it has the right properties for efficient operation. Different refrigerants are used depending on the application, but all must be non-toxic, non-flammable, and have a low environmental impact. In conclusion, the refrigeration cycle is a process that is used to cool a substance or space by removing heat from the surrounding environment. It consists of four main components, the compressor, the condenser, the expansion valve, and the evaporator. Understanding the refrigeration cycle is crucial for anyone involved in the design, operation, or maintenance of refrigeration and air conditioning systems. Thank you for watching and we hope this video has helped to shed some light on the refrigeration cycle.